I didn't expect to find the world's savior alone on Christmas Eve. Can I talk to you for a minute? First off, thank you for taking my request. With your actions, I can only hope that public opinion changes. It will change, won't it? I believe so too. Shido confessed to a variety of crimes. We can arrest him on those charges. The problem lies in proving him guilty. It'd be difficult unless the correlation between the metaverse and the mental shutdowns is made. I'll be blunt. I want you to turn yourself in to the police. Your testimony will be necessary in order to prove Shido guilty. However... That will mean placing you on center stage. You'll be treated as a hero who saved this country. But there's no way that the police or the public prosecutors will let that slide. If you turn yourself into the police, you'll definitely be arrested. I'll close all the cases surrounding Shido. I intend to expose them all. It's to prevent society from becoming distorted again. That's what you want too, isn't it? I'll ask you once more. I'd like for you to turn yourself into the police, of your own accord. There's no need for that. You! If they get their hands on the perpetrator, there'll be no need for him to turn himself in, no? Don't worry. I'm the real deal. You said, there's no need. Just what do you mean by that? Exactly as it sounds. I'll agree to testify against Shido and his crimes. I assume that works for you? You're overthinking this. I have no hidden agenda at this point. If I had to explain myself, I'd say it's simply personal principle that I repay my debts. For the time being, at least, I'll take your word that you'll cooperate with the investigation. That would save a lot of time. I'm sorry. You can forget everything I just told you. I'll take them in myself. I won't try to claim that everything will turn out perfectly for you, but I would bet this case will reach its natural conclusion. No, in fact, I swear that this will be properly settled. Acho que o Aquete nos livrou dessa. Como que o Aquete? Ah, eu não pude dizer isso mais cedo, mas. Vamos nos encontrar? Só nós dois? Nós. Podemos manter esse segredo de todo mundo? O que, que acha de jantarmos juntos em algum lugar e depois voltar pro seu quarto? Oh, parece que eu tenho mais mensagens. Eu falei com o Sojuro e ele parece que ele não liga. Então, eu tenho uma proposta. Vamos passar a véspera de Natal juntos? Eu quero um bolo e frango também. E aí a gente vai pro seu quarto. Uh, mais mensagem? Uh. Sob tais circunstâncias, eu não sabia se eu devia falar, mas... Eu quero passar a véspera de Natal com você. Talvez pudéssemos andar pela cidade um pouco e... Então voltarmos pro seu quarto? E parece que tem mais mensagem. Meu Deus! A igreja certamente está cheia de vida. Eles estão preparando tudo para os feriados. Mas a tradição também diz que casais precisam passar essa noite juntos, correto? Eu gostaria de tirar uma folga do Shogi e... A 
apenas passar o tempo com você. E elas não param. As mensagens não acabam e... Eu sei que eu devia me conter, dada a situação. Mas é véspera de Natal e eu queria passar ela junto com você. Você acha que poderíamos andar pela cidade, então... Voltar para o seu quarto? Meu Deus do céu, cara. Parece teleton, não acaba a ligação. Eu li o meu destino e... Dizia que você tinha que fazer o seu melhor para aprofundar os seus laços com o seu docinho. Acha que sou bom para você? Ou tá muito ocupada? Eu, eu, eu tô ocupado lendo meus sales. Eu terminei o trabalho da escola já. Nós podemos passar a véspera de Natal juntos, se você quiser. Sem pressão, é claro. Meu Deus do céu! Ah! Quando você está acostumado às horas do hospital, o Natal não significa muito mais coisa. Mas eu pensei que você iria gostar de passar ele junto como um casal. Nós podemos passar a véspera de Natal juntos, se você quiser. Meu Deus, só queria fazer confidence pra ter status. Ai, meu Deus. As coisas têm sido bem difíceis ultimamente, mas... Vamos tirar o dia de folga. Então, podemos passar ele juntos. Talvez pudéssemos tomar um chá ou ir pro seu quarto. Com quem eu deveria passar um tempo? Céus! Que decisão difícil! Legal. Você sabe que eu vou pegar, não é? Ela, no fim das contas, pra mim é... A garota ideal do Joker. Mas isso é só pra mim. Não significa que pra vocês tem que ser. Vocês não precisam concordar com isso. Eu estou em Shibuya agora. Vamos nos encontrar em frente à estação. E olha só que coincidência. Eu também estou em Shibuya. Vamos para lá, então. Sorry about this. I know it's a special day, but that's also why I wanted to see you. Honestly, you always have that charm ready, but thanks. It's just about time for dinner, so why don't we find a place to eat? Okay, let's go. Oh, uh, come to think of it, uh, well, It is a cold Christmas Eve, so... Do you want to hold hands? I can't believe we couldn't find a single table. At least we can try to get a cake here, but... Even this place is so crowded. D thank you. I feel the same way. Wait, focus. We've got a cake to buy. Let's get going. It doesn't look like they have anything. Well, maybe we'd better find another place. You're not the market for a Christmas cake, are you? Oh, um, we are, actually. Ah, fantastic! One of our orders was canceled last minute. You're kidding! I guess it's your lucky night. So, do you want to buy it? Well, if it's really all right... Then yes, we'll take it. Of course! Just wait one moment while I go prepare your order. I'm honestly stunned. This kind of thing never happens, right? Sure, we'll go with that. <laughs> It's so good. Right? Maybe it was a good thing all the restaurants turned us away. O oh, right. Here, before I forget, I got you a present. I... I have to say, um, my life's gotten a lot more unpredictable since I met you, but we got through everything so far. And it's made me realize I wouldn't want it any other way. I thought you might like this watch, just in case we, uh, lose track of time together. It's really nothing fancy, but I'm glad you like it. Oh, wait. Don't move. <laughs> you had 
some cream on your nose. How did that even get there? <laughs> I usually don't laugh this much on Christmas, but I guess it's not just the holidays. Meeting you's helped me see so much humor, even excitement in the most trivial things. You helped me find so many new experiences beyond the life I'd known. Thank you for spending Christmas with me. And for loving me. Oh, you. <laughs> oh, look! It's so beautiful! Snow must have picked up after we got back. Coming back to LeBlanc really was the smart move. Now... We get to enjoy the view. I didn't know I could be this happy. It almost doesn't feel real. You're right. It's just so different from how things used to be. Hey, it's getting pretty bad out there. As much snow is bound to stop the train schedules. Hope you don't mind, but I'll be staying a little longer. Akechi did what? He turned himself into the police. Sis told me yesterday. He's admitted to being the perpetrator behind the recent cases. So he's alive. Akechi couldn't survived and owned up to what he did. Well, I feel it's for the best. If Akechi kun is alive and he can atone for his crimes, that's not a bad turn of events. Right. Ain't that all stuff to be happy about? Mm-hmm. It's Christmas. We should enjoy the day to our heart's content. I approve. Let everyone be merry to the max. I'm the one who should be giving permission, you know. Well, as long as you don't go overboard, I guess you can go ahead and cut loose today. Hell yeah! Merry Christmas! He didn't hear a word of that. <sighs> Fine. My, this is quite a sight. I'm going to be entirely honest. I wasn't able to bring a dish. Instead, leave the dishwashing duties to me. I'll make sure they turn out beautifully immaculate. Hmm. Why don't we all just clean up together? So, who brought what? I brought that marinated seafood. Mmm! Oh, that's super good! It may not be to everyone's tastes, but I brought that cheese plate. Whoa! That smells like dirty socks. Oh! <laughs> mm. Oh! But it tastes great! Ah, thank goodness. Oh, is this a croque and bouche? It's so cute! I made that all by myself. All I did was buy some cream puffs and stack them up, though. It's been arranged so artistically that I hesitate to sample it. When it comes to sweets, An truly has us beat. But then, who brought this box over here? Ooh, this looks like more sweets. Not mine, by the way. Uh, me? K kinda? Ryuji brought sweets? Ryuji and sweets? Sweets. Hey, what are you guys getting at? It was just a bit unexpected is all. I had expected something along the lines of meat. For some reason, chicken comes to mind when I think of you. Ryuji, chicken? Um, I'm sorry. I didn't mean that in any sort of comparative way. Please don't keep going. It just hurts even more. Did you 
hear what I just said? Come on, don't get all depressed. Everyone's here to party. Everyone. Oh. Mona-chan. I was trying my best not to mention it, but it's hard to avoid. If only Mona could be here with us. Someone call for me? Yeah, we were just talking about... Huh? Wait, what? No way! I thought you disappeared! Looks like the only me that disappeared was the one in the metaverse. So, you stayed in reality as a cat? When I woke up, I was out in Shibuya looking like this. I headed back here right away, but it took a surprising amount of time. If you were coming back here, you should have told us, moron! We were so worried. Sheesh. Well, I brought my own surprise back, too. I brought some fried chicken. This doesn't have anything to do with your conversation earlier, though. <laughs> Any room left on the table? Oh, now there's our chief for ya. Talk about everything falling into place. Come on, let's get started. We're gonna party to celebrate our hard work and my grand return. Don't push your luck. Things are finally back to normal. Tudo fica bem quando termina bem. Ah, persona. Que final digno de. Feliz Natal, pessoal! Yay! Tem foto da. Uh, que legal! Ai. É uma coisa tão fofa. <risos> Ai, o Morgana voltou também, então. Eu tô tão feliz. Céus, eu acho que eu vou chorar de novo. Ai, Lirinha. Eu tô feliz de voltar também. É, eu acho que ele também tá feliz. <risos> Aqui tá uma foto de você, Mona. Uma bela foto que eu tirei depois da festa. Uh, cara, que legal. Mas que foto esplêndida. Sim, de alguma forma... Ver vocês dois juntos me deixa mais calma. Você e ele são bem próximos, não é, Jack? É... Eu e Mona... Já passamos por muita coisa. Somos família, hã? Então eu basicamente sou seu irmão mais velho, né? Ué, ué, calma lá. <risos> Enfim, uh, não vai desaparecer de novo, tá bom? Eu não quero me preocupar com você nunca mais. Futaba. É isso aí. Hoje era pra ser uma noite de celebração, então Eu fico feliz de ter feito parte dela Sabe? Eu já disse isso, mas Obrigado, pessoal Eu fico feliz de ter voltado pra vocês ah. E aí, Mona? Bom dia eu literalmente bocejei, eu tentei bocejar de mentira, mas eu bocejei de verdade. <risos> Falta só mais um dia pra ano novo. Eu sei que é meio de repente, mas devemos fazer uma festa de fim de ano. Eu top! <risos> Você que vai organizar isso, foi tava tia. <risos> Obrigada por nos avisar. O Sonja já tá fazendo soba de ano novo pra todo mundo. Nesse caso, será que deveríamos nos reunir durante a noite aí? Eu posso chamar a minha irmã? Vai em frente! O lugar todo tá reservado pra gente. Então, a gente devia chamar Yoshizawa também, né? Morgana e a Futaba já falaram disso antes, mas... Ela ajudou muito no palace aquele dia. E é ano novo, então... É como se ela estivesse ocupada treinando mesmo. Eu concordo. Então, Jack, você oficialmente vai ser o nosso pomo-correio. É o seu trabalho falar com ela. Ó, oh, pode deixar. Tá bom, eu vejo vocês amanhã. A year-end party, huh? I'm already excited. Oh, let's invite Yoshizawa right away. Thank you for inviting me. Although, I admit, I feel a bit like I'm intruding. There's no need for modesty. After all we've been through, there are no strangers here. 
Yeah, you really helped him out too. In that case, I'll accept your offer. Yo, I really can't stop staring at that thing you're wearing. <laughs> so it's caught your eye as well. It happened to catch mine while I was strolling through the city. I bought it for myself as a reward for the end of the year. What do you think about the scarf? <laughs> You've recognized its unique beauty as well. I'd say it's a little too unique. <laughs> this fashion chat is fine and all, but if you don't dig into that soba soon, it's gonna get soggy on you. Ah, oh, yes. My apologies. Thank you for the food. It's chow time! Mmm! So good! Sakura-san, you made these noodles yourself, right? They're amazing! You could open a soba restaurant! Oh, thanks. I made a little too much, so if anyone wants a refill... Seconds, please! How fast do you eat? You eat a lot more than I'd assumed you do, Yoshizawa-san. I don't know if that fully explains what's happening here. Senpai, don't kid them so much. My appetite's totally normal. Breaking news on our top story. After nearly two weeks of silence, the prosecutor's office is planning to move forward with the biggest case of the year. They have announced that they will move forward in the charging of Representative Shido for his confessed crimes. It's finally happening. I was planning on telling all of you about this a little later. This case is all thanks to a certain man's testimony. But I can at least share this one piece of good news with you. And that would be? The woman involved in his false charge case has finally come forward and provided her testimony. I can't say for certain yet, but his criminal record may very well be overturned. For real? Then that's wonderful! Congratulations, Senpai! Of course, this is highly confidential, got it? What great news! Looks like we really will be having a happy new year. This is incredible! It's an actual, real-life good ending! And after that, the two-hour New Year's special of Tokyo Vice. A thrilling tale jam-packed with some of the network's most famous faces. I'll never give up! I've been seeing this guy on TV all the time lately. Oh yeah, he's a model-turned-actor. With a figure like that, I can see how he's gotten so popular. So he's popular, eh? If I were more like that human, maybe Lady Anne would... The year is winding down to its final moments. Let's take a look at how people are spending it all across the country. Now that I'm thinking about it, hell of a lot sure did happen this year. Right? It's like, how many years of our lives did we actually live through this year? I doubt we'll experience anything even similar to it for quite some time. Well, this is just from my point of view, but I really hope that's the case. <laughs> and I guess starting next year, we'll just be good boys and girls at school. If that's the case, then I assume you'll be able to handle your summer break homework on your own, right? Please don't go there, Senpai. I don't think I see that happening. <laughs> okay, that's a fine. Fine, fine. <laughs> can't do it alone. I mean, what do I even do as an honor student? <sighs> so much has happened over the past 12 months. But in the end, we got to spend it together like this. I want to believe that this was a great year for us. Yeah, I don't have any proof, but I feel like next year is going to be even better for us. I feel the exact same way. How strange. Well, that's only natural, considering how pleased we are with our end-of-year celebration. Young people have been gathering in Shibuya all day for the big countdown at midnight, and this crowd is... I really don't want to get going, but it seems like it's time. See you next year, right? Next year? <gasps> Sojiro! Oseji time! Get those New Year's dishes ready! Chop chop! And don't forget the black beans! Yeah, yeah, I hear ya. If I start prepping the beans now, they'll be ready by the morning. Don't worry about the food. You just go have a good night's sleep. 
Legal, agora é sério. Pra onde que vai tudo que a Yoshizawa come? Holy shit. Uh, feliz ano novo! Yeah! A droga! Já é ano novo! Uh, feliz ano novo! Yeah! Ano passado parece que foi ontem. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, devemos nos reunir pra uma festa ou alguma coisa assim. Só pra celebrar, sabe? Tem alguma coisa em mente? Ah, eu sei lá, alguma coisa pra comer mote ou alguma coisa assim. Então seria uma coisa super desprovida de. de, de cordialidades. Ah, eu não sei o que faríamos mais. Eu sou super top se vocês quiserem. Eu também. Mas não amanhã. Eu tenho planos. Eu também. Sinto muito. Ah, ah! Mas qualquer outra hora, tudo bem por mim. Então depois a gente vê uma data. Enfim, feliz ano novo, galera. Que esse ano seja incrível pra nós. Hum. Hey, don't tell this to the others, ok? But even after I disappeared, I was still vaguely conscious. And being separated from all of you was really scary. I thought, if it's even a little bit possible, I wanted to come home to you guys. That's why I'm so glad I was able to come back here. Yeah. Thanks. Well, it's pretty late. Let's get to sleep. I know I've said this before, but I hope we keep sticking together like this. Onde é que eu tô? Class will be dismissed momentarily. What? Class will be dismissed momentarily. Ah, a moça, conserta esse microfone, tá meio surrado. Ah, eu sinto que eu tenho que ir logo para casa. Nossa, não. É o meu pior pesadelo. Eu durmo e acordo na escola. Eu preciso ir pra casa. Mas a que custo? Eu estou acordando de pijama no meio da escola. Tá legal. Um... Uh, é, eu tinha muita curiosidade pra ver isso daqui. É, parece que não podemos invocar a nossa persona aqui. Tudo bem, então. Eu acho que só temos o resultado de track meets alongside everyone else on the team and eventually I get a hold of some scholarships for college to make things easier for my mom. Eu consigo ouvir uma voz, mas de quem é? Huh. Se ao menos eu tivesse um mínimo de reconhecimento das vozes das pessoas que eu conheço. Oh, ah. Uma borboleta. Eu deveria segui-la. Ok. Ei, borboleta, volta aqui. Oh. Ok. Uh... Eu não sei por que que eu tô tendo esse sonho. Eu não comi nada demais lá na festa. Oh. Tá bom, aparentemente não tem animação de eu passando pela porta. Volta aqui, borboletinha. My sister's been supporting the family. It's unrealistic to demand any more of her. Ok. Cadê esse inseto estúpido azul? Ah. Aí tá aí. I'm helping Okumura ah. Foods grow, with my father watching over me. Mas quem é o seu pai? Voz estranha na minha cabeça. Ah. Isso é bem assustador de se pensar. Mas bom, eu acho que estamos chegando na saída dessa escola finalmente. Será que tem a que suba a pena ali? Não, a moça não deve estar tá vendendo nada hoje. Para onde você está indo? Uh, pra casa? Eu acho. Para casa? Mas. Não é lá onde você pertence. Hum. Entendo. Então você ainda não aceitou. Bem, eu não vou forçá-lo a nada. 
nos veremos de novo. Eu sinto que eu tive um sonho muito bizarro. O que será que ele significava? Ah. No mínimo intrigante. Wait, what the? Good morning. Bom dia, Yoshizawa. Ah, você ainda tá dormindo? Torna seu pai? É. Parece que nunca tem uma boa resposta pra isso, cara. Um... Sempre me sinto grosso respondendo, mas... Au, oh, me desculpa. Eu não sabia que você tava dormindo. Enfim, eu me sinto meio estranho de te perguntar isso agora que você acordou, mas... Se lembra de prometer pra mim que nós iríamos nos encontrar no templo juntos no ano novo? Au! Oh. Eu me... Eu me esqueci completamente. Ups! Digo, eu não deixei muito claro, não é? Ainda assim. Eu sei que é um pouco abusado da minha parte, mas... O que você me diz de me acompanhar no Templo Meiji hoje de tarde? Uh, claro. Já estou ansioso. I'm so happy. É sério? Obrigada. Provavelmente vai estar bem lotado hoje, mas... Não deve estar Tão ruim se a gente for de tarde. É, espero que sim. Mas vai ficar tudo bem. <risos> eu também acho. Eu vou rezar pros deuses pra não estar tão cheio assim por lá. Oh, droga, eu espero que você não tenha contado com o meu pedido de ano novo. <risos> Ei, já acordou? Bem, então vamos nos encontrar no templo de tarde. Até lá. Tchau, tchau, amor. Ah. Você acordou? Então vem me dar uma mãozinha aqui. Tô indo, Sojiro. Sorry to make work your first activity of the new year. Oh, that reminds me. Happy New Year. And I hope you'll continue getting along with Futamba and myself. We're especially grateful you're open today. You know how everything on TV for New Year's is the same old, same old. Say, boss, don't you have any plans for this morning? I could cook some up, so long as you serve yourself everything and pay your bill on the way out. Ah, right. <laughs> Can't exactly make plans when you've already got customers. How about you, young man? Are you going to the shrine for the New Year? That's a wise choice. Happy New Year. That's what you say today, right? Nice meeting you too. But wait, what are you talking about? Are you still half asleep or something? Oh, looking sharp. Oh, you look absolutely lovely, Futaba-chan. <laughs> I picked it out with my mom. Sorry, I don't want to be late to the shrine. More showing off comes later. Well, time to make like a tree. The year's first shrine visit, eh? What do you think we should do? Well... Perhaps we don't need to go this year. We don't have any more wishes that need granting. Desculpa, mas eu acho que vou acabar chegando mais cedo do que eu esperava. E lá tá bem menos lotado do que eu pensava também. Será que meu desejo se tornou realidade? Hum, eu acho que é só sorte nossa. Ou então o pessoal não tá muito afim de comemorar. Eu vou estar esperando na entrada quando eu chegar lá. Não se preocupe, tá bom? Não precisa se apressar. What's up? Did you have plans for today or something? Oh, come on, you should have just said as much then. I'll be fine here, so off you go. Have fun. Oh, but it's pretty cold out there, so don't forget to dress warm so you don't catch a bug.
cleared? <laughs> Sorry for the short notice. I couldn't send you a New Year's card, so here we are. Well, shall we? <sighs> I wonder why. There aren't many people here at all. It's really unexpected. I'd almost prefer the usual crowd. Yeah, and the end of the year was just a few hours ago. Mm -hmm. Believe it or don't, only 364 <laughs> days until the next one. That is true, but... I know I'm gonna use the wrong year for a while. Well, I have an idea. New Year's party tonight to help switch <laughs> gears? Uh -huh. huh? Didn't expect you two here. <laughs> Coincidences can there be in one day? And a good morn unto you all. I haven't seen you in absolute ages. <laughs> we were hanging out just yesterday. Oh, I guess we all had plans to drop by here first thing today, huh? That would explain what led us to the shrine, but to this spot at the exact same time? Talk about incredible happenstance. Indeed, but due to this fortuitous turn of fate, I am able to witness this mesmerizing sight. Truly the embodiment of Japanese beauty. What are you doing, Kitagawa-senpai? Just ignore him. It's like a fit he gets into sometimes. So, what do you want to do after this? If we've got the time for it, why don't we grab something to eat together? I'm sorry, I'll be heading out with my family once we're finished here. I have somewhere to be as well. Me too. I'll be dining with my father somewhere. I'm gonna hit up some New Year's sales with my mom. Well, looks like you're all busy. And maybe I should hit up the track team and see what they're up to. Ooh, I'll get in touch with Shiho and find out if she has any plans yet. Well, I guess we'll all just go do our own thing then. Mm -hmm. See you later. Looks like it's just us now. Oh, I was wondering earlier, what did you wish for at the Shrine, Senpai? <laughs> well, we did just run into everyone else. Maybe that was your wish. Me? Well... Oh, I'm sorry. It's from my dad. Uh... He's telling me that some relatives have come over to the house, so I have to go home and spend some time with them. He decided to come all the way out to the station to get me. My family's kind of serious about their get-togethers. I'm really sorry. I was the one who invited you here and everything. At least allow me to accompany you to the station. Dad! You should hold on to your sleeve. That is your dress kimono, after all. <clears throat> now, who do we have here? I believe this is our first time meeting. This is my senpai. The one I told you about before? My senpai who's done so much for me. Oh, so you're her senpai. My daughter talks about you all the time. D dad not all the time! <laughs> Is that not so? I was told you picked these out for me too. I know it's pretty late for it, but thank you all the same. all the time, even at work. I'm quite the fan of them. Well, shall we get going? What? Hmm? Something wrong? Uh, no. Nothing. Well then, Senpai, please excuse us.
Ei, nós vamos ter o nosso primeiro sonho do ano hoje? Nós? Eu achava que isso fosse só amanhã à noite. Isso importa mesmo. Você só vai ter o sonho quando você tiver que ter. Ei, isso é importante, tá bom? Eu não posso deixar meu primeiro sonho ser um pesadelo. Então ele não conta como um sonho, né? Aqui tem uma foto. Talvez isso te ajude a ter um bom sonho. Uou! <risos> ah, quando foi que vocês tiraram isso? Foi logo antes da gente se encontrar com vocês. Nós esbarramos umas nas outras no início. Embora eu ache que devíamos ter tirado uma foto em grupo juntas. Essa foto é bonita do jeito que está. De fato, eu acredito que trará muita inspiração para os meus sonhos. <risos> Mas você precisa ter um sonho muito específico se você quer ter um bom ano, né não? Que tradição era essa de novo do monte Fuji, da ovelha, sei lá. É, parece meio estranho. <risos> é do monte Fuji, do... Falcão e também da planta de ovo. Planta de ovo? Não. Não pode ser isso. Uh, é, é isso aí. Eu. Tem que sonhar com isso. <risos> Sinceramente, eu duvido que você consiga forçar o seu sonho. Mas eu planejo sonhar com uma beleza singular. Eu vou pra cama logo. Enfim, eu vou treinar amanhã também. É, boa sorte, Ridge, com isso. O que aconteceu essa tarde não deve ter sido normal. Uma coisa errada aqui. Hum, mistérios. What's up? Huh? I was just sleeping. Hey, you've been acting kind of weird since yesterday. What's going on? Are you two still sleeping? Your lunch is gonna pull a vanishing act if you don't come down soon. Ooh. Oh, you can go on ahead. I'll be down in a sec. All perfectly shaped and so shiny. Looks like your recipes have reached housewife level quality. You trying to get hitched sometime soon? <laughs> Thanks, but no. Hey, come join us. Try the sweet black beans, they'll change your life. Good morning. Oh, is this your first gag of the new year? <laughs> Trunk on the spirit of the new year already, huh? I'll warn you not to try any pranks with Wakaba. It'll only blow up in your face. She'll tease you forever until she finally bores herself. You know me too well. Wakaba. Your work and your kid were so fulfilling for you. Why'd you have to die so suddenly? What's up? Not feeling so good? He's been like this since yesterday. Morning, Mona. Morning. Do you think there's enough Osechi for me to join you? What's that a question? Of course I'm me. Seriously, are you all right? Okay, that's enough joking around for now. Go ahead and grab a seat. I bet you're just hungry. Thank you for the food. I can't remember the last time I actually got to relax and enjoy myself on a New Year's like this. I'm stuffed too. If only I had something to cap off this meal. Like a cup of coffee? Boy, that was a subtle request. Oh, does anybody want dessert with their coffee? I'll go pick it up. My treat. You want a Mont Blanc, right, Mom? Oh, how kind. Thank you. All right, I shall return. 
Be careful. What's the matter? <sighs> Sorry, we haven't opened for the day yet. My apologies. I merely wish to speak with him for a moment. Why don't you go and get some fresh air with him? I'll stand guard over your dessert for you. You say that now, but when he gets back and his dessert's gone, I'm pretty sure he'll suspect it was an inside job. I can definitely see that happening with Mona on guard duty. Hey, come on, guys. <laughs> sorry, sorry. <laughs> I guess I'll start the coffee. You know, don't you? We have to discuss this. That's what I need to discuss with you. Come on. Well then, let's try to sort through this situation. That seems as good a place to begin as any. At the end of last year, I turned myself into the police as the perpetrator of the serial psychotic breakdown incidents. Your memory of this is still intact, correct? Ah, yes. So, my final enemy is a puppet version of myself. I... We have greater concerns right now. In fact, I'm a bit offended you think so little of me that you expected me to be dead. Perhaps the most confusing part of my story comes post-detainment. Obviously, I was thoroughly interrogated about my involvement in Shido's case. But for some reason, after questioning, I was suddenly released. No explanation whatsoever. I agree. No matter how one attempts to rationalize it, my release is extremely unusual. More than that, it should be impossible for them to release a confessing suspect after only a brief interrogation. But what's even more unbelievable to me is... That's right. Wakaba Ishiki. I can't believe she's been brought back to life. For the time being, you seem to be the only one who's still in their right frame of mind. I should get to the point. Let's make a deal. Let's say we join forces on this. I want to investigate what exactly is happening here. I'm fairly certain you wish to find out the same thing, no? For the time being, you and I share the same goal. To solve this problem, don't you agree that it'd be safer for us to partner up? Have you made up your mind? Well... First, I need information. Can you tell me what happened after... parting ways with me in Shido's palace? I see. Though some abnormalities appeared immediately, the most glaring ones arrived after the New Year. And all of the Phantom Thieves, with you as the sole exception, are living in this altered reality without even realizing it. Go ahead. Senpai, it's Yoshizawa. I'm in Odaiba right now, and, uh... Um, I don't really understand what I'm seeing, but I'm just going to describe it to you. It's that building. It's really faint, but I can see that palace thing that Morgana-senpai mentioned a while ago. 
Senpai, I know this is sudden, but could you come to Odaiba right away? I understand. I'll see you soon. That was Yoshizawa-san's voice, wasn't it? I believe I heard her say the word palace. Despite not being in the metaverse. You're planning to meet up with Yoshizawa-san, right? I'll join you. We're all but guaranteed to find a clue there. Now that we've made ourselves a new deal, you wouldn't turn me down, would you? We just happened to be together when he got your call. First a dead woman returns, and now a palace appears. How intriguing. Akechi-san, you know about palaces? Would it help you grasp the situation if I told you that I have the same powers he has? Really? Does that mean you're also... Allow me to stop you there. I'm not a part of the Phantom Thieves. However, since you've already grasped the concept, it's clear to me that you're a fellow Persona user. Um... Yes, I can use a Persona as well. I'm not a part of the Phantom Thieves either, though. I just so happened to slip into this palace with him and Morgana Senpai a while ago. But what could be the meaning behind its appearance here? I just happened to be passing by on my way home when I came across it. Since nobody else is making a scene about it, I assume others aren't able to see it. Or they see it, but it doesn't evoke any real reaction in them. Yes, that's exactly it. I asked some people in the area, and none of them seem to care at all about its appearance. Hmm. Rather than simply hypothesize out here, we may be better off taking immediate action. You mean, we should go into the palace? Not only has a palace manifested in reality, but this is the only one visible to us. I realize I have no proof, but it's highly likely that this is related to our current incomprehensible situation. Wouldn't it be more efficient to just go inside and see what we can learn? That is, if we have the means to do so. Oh, it's... I thought it was gone for good, but it looks like we've regained access to the nav. I have it as well. Is there a search history? Search history? How do I check... Ah, oh, there's one search in the log, but... Ugh. The name portion of the entry has been censored somehow. Could this be the doing of the palace's ruler? Does that mean we can't enter the palace? Well, we do have the search history, so it should be possible to infiltrate it anyway. If you're going in, would you be willing to bring me with you? I can't put my finger on it, but something's been bothering me about this place ever since we first entered it. I promise I won't slow you down. What's your call? We're going in, together. All right. Let's do it. Now that I'm getting a second look here, I've noticed just how mysterious this place is. What could this building even be? It depends on what the palace's ruler thinks of the place. We'll likely find that out if we keep pushing forward. Is that so? By the way, um... What's the matter? Well, uh, I'm not sure how to put it. That one? 
Oh, you mean this old thing? Yoshizawa's on aside. There's no reason for me to uphold the pretense of a righteous, sincere detective prince. Enough chatting. Let's move out. Yeah, parece que as coisas ainda não acabaram. Estamos numa onda de várias coisas estranhas aqui. Muita gente voltando dos mortos e... Até mesmo se aliando a nós. A Cat, o que você tá tramando, cara? E bom, não só isso, mas... Também temos esse palace que... De alguma forma ainda está aqui. Parece que podemos entrar nele mesmo sem o metaverse existindo de fato. Ou será que ele existe? Bom... Temos que descobrir isso. Não sabemos nem sequer quem é o governante dele. Temos muitos mistérios para desvendar agora no novo semestre de Persona 5 Royal. Eu espero que vocês estejam tão ansiosos quanto eu. Então é isso. O mais que eu queira. Eu vou encerrar esse vídeo aqui agora e... Nos vemos no próximo episódio. Até lá. Tchau, tchau.